So your next step is how are you going to prove to the school and the classroom that your child is indeed reading? Because our kids are not fond of performing on demand at school and we all know that. So I suggest you video her at home performing in one of those ways when she's comfortable and she feels like cooperating and then send that into the classroom, send that to the teacher and make sure it's viewed. All right, we're gonna build a sentence. The milk is down. Okay, okay. what's first? The, the, good. Mm, no, you didn't look. We're not gonna pretend. Milk, that's good. Is, all right, let's straighten it out. Down, good. Okay, now you read it for me, all right? The, the uh, mm -hmm. milk is down. Yay, you did it! And this is very important that the teacher actually knows the real reading ability of your child. Because as many of us have found out, the classroom is likely to assume that if the child can't speak, the child is also not very bright. And trust me, some of my students with severe apraxia are super sharp cookies. So on the next slide, I'll give you some homework that'll give you some more tips. See you next time.